course, our, our Baron will not appreciate the vastness of this, uh, this bedroom, but, you know, it's fine. One kind of upset dwarf, the Miller. Annoyed dwelling upon having a drink without using a goblet cup or muck. You know what? Fine. And let's say. Probably can shear animals again.
farmers workshops. Bucklers again? Are we still in the because I still need charcoal. Probably more iron in here somewhere. Elven caravan has arrived. Woohoo! I landed? That never happens. Give you a single crystal opal. Also, some rock salt figurines. And some cool conglomerate figurines. And dolomite figurines. If anybody's looking for a dwarf, you just have to say so. I'll, I'll name a dwarf after you. We'll read the, des the description and all that. Um, yeah. If you have any questions, feel free to ask. Always welcome to just lurk about. That is fine. They have a sloth and a leopard? Never had a sloth before. Uh, also, instruments. Yeah, that's good enough.
bump in the microphone, I apologize for that. need like 40 bedrooms. Oops. Oh, we're gonna need coffins. Well, thanks for stopping in, Blink Chick. <laughs> I appreciate you. Thanks for coming in on the YouTube side. Yeah, I'm here Monday through Friday, 6.30 uh, Eastern, so that's uh, 11.30 UTC. That's AM. And I usually do uh, productivity, but then on the weekends and on some Fridays, I do some uh, Dwarf Fort. And yeah, thanks for stopping in. Thanks for saying hi. Doctor's Guild now. Well, a Doctor's Guild I am happy to have. So our hospital is right here. I can put the Doctor's Guild inside this.
kill Paul for the darkness. smooth that too. Once again, I see animals that need to be pastured up here. Definitely getting to the point where I have too many animals. Oh, right, we have a sloth and a leopard. I should put the sloth in here anyways. what I was wondering about. Uh, the lion can stay in there, but I think we'll put the leopard. Actually, yeah, we'll put the lion in there too. So I definitely saw them doing something there. Did we end up making cheese or did we just make... I don't think that worked. Okay. Cutting down a tree ends up getting injured. Good job. Okay, how many other woodcutters do we have? None? Yeah, we need more. We also need to take care of some of our pets here. All right. Um, if you're not an alpaca or a llama, you gotta justify your existence.
Reindeer. <laughs> Donkey and horse. Buck rabbit. Buck rabbit. Donkey. And it occurs to me I only have like one butcher and one. Oh no, I have two butchers and two tanners. Okay. Good, good, good. Never mind. Back. 
Advent and Summer. Still a couple of chests, a couple of cabinets. fast enough because we're not making charcoal fast enough because we don't have enough wood. And a human caravan has arrived. Ooh, with wagons. With wagons. I'm sorry, did I not make figurines? Cages? Sure.
said that they didn't feel vengeful entering an existing conflict, but I don't see what the conflict was with. Oh, a dingo. We have dingoes, huh? All right, broker, do your job. Proposed a ban on chains. Take the picks. You know what? We'll take this pike. Logs and that's it. And go. Alright, fine. We'll take it. Alright, um noticed like, any need for clothing. Alright, there's something. Trousers, shirt, gloves. Socks. Trousers, shirts, gloves, and socks. except for coal. <laughs> Floats your boat, buddy. We'll just have a couple of windows in the middle of the floor. That's normal, right? Oh, Rhesus Macax again. 
Well, luckily the merchants are here to really mess things up. Well, apparently we have dingo kidneys now. Yum. company has been satisfied. Excellent. You're fighting all the rhesus macaques out there. We don't have enough bedrooms. Still, also, apparently I need more furniture in here. your bedroom eventually. I don't promise anything, but eventually. Alright, so we have this bedroom set. 